we're in a different situation now where Narendra Modi requires the help and assistance of a handful of regional parties, which can make or break his government, right? So that means going forward, he is going to have to govern in a manner that is more consultative, uh, that is more inclusive, but that tries to bring people along. But I think it's pretty clear that on the ground, there is a lot of economic disenchantment, particularly among people who are lower down the socioeconomic ladder. And they feel that, yes, we have benefited from welfare goods, which this government has provided, and we're grateful for that. Uh, but that has not translated into higher incomes, uh, better employment, uh, social mobility for my family and for my children. For Congress, a clear victory was around 100 seats. Uh, because that would mean they've made enough of a dent uh, in the BJP's tally to force them to govern uh, in a coalition format. And the Congress at last count, I think, has 99 seats, right? So they did well. They were also lifted uh, by the, 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 the hard work and good fortunes of their coalition allies, right? Um, and I think uh, that's an important uh, message from this campaign is, yes, the Congress has new wind in its sails, 